Hi, how are you? I hope you're doing well. My name is Ndenya and welcome to SPM Buzz. Learn me all the time, Sani Mekwam Kinyulizia, all my Kamba people. This is a king in the Kamba industry music. Alex Mambo. Poor Sana. Kwaji. Kwa salama. Ebuji introduce. Pia mi ni kopoji introduce kwa lewa tu akujui. Majinangu ni Alex Kasau Kulukulu. Ama Katombi. Katombi is my grandfather. Father's name. Ah, yeah. Ube ichukua. It's a family name. It's a family name. Uh -huh. Pia ya likuwa na imba. So, oh, it runs in the family. Yes, yes. Alikuwa na ito waje tuwane katu na mjua? Uwezi mjua. Ni enzi ya mababu. Oh. Hey, uwezi mjua. He's way older. He's way older. Bado yuko? I, I've never even seen him. Oh, yeah. Hey. Oh, yeah. Hey, Sijai uh -huh. mwana. Uh -huh. Unajua kikamba, sinu? Eh, nini isi kikamba? Enda, ndia mwede ya, na kiti otapuwa story ya likuwa na imba, ya. Sasa aki watu wangu wamekulizia Alex. Hey, Alex upatikani, you're very busy. Sio kupatikana. Niko, the only problem is the time I have. Nitha, ni kwa atende nundu mbanji ni kuna from Wednesdays, Thursdays, so unapumzika Monday ama Tuesday. So kupata time ya interview, ni tricky. Ya, siyo kukata. Nelewa kabisa. Ningetika kujua, cause umekua kwa the top of the game, over the years, over the years, over the years. Ni chao, kikamba yangu kidogo wacha tujaribu. Ni nini weza sema imekueka apo over all those years? First thing, yangu ni talent. Ya, it's not, chika mabiyashara. So, jua biyashara unezaanzisha ianguke. But talent, you can even stay there forever. Depending na your content, na how you treat people around you. So, mi nimekua kwa industry juu. Siezi jigamba, but I think I know the industry more. Na najua venye watu wangu wanapenda. Yes. Umekua kwa industry miaka ngapi? So far, 20. 20. Yes, 20 years. Eh. <laughs> Ebu, ongeleshe ule msani ya meanza tu iza kamba artist na ndoa meanza uneza mwambia nini? Sio kazi raisi. Uh, juu ni kianza, nilicheza like 10, 10 albums. Mm -hmm. Ni kianza. I used to sing 10 songs per album. Mm -hmm. Tukaimba lakini kutoka yo time life haikuwa mzuri. So, it takes time. A lot of time for you to stand in a music, na ukai. It took me like 10 years, kabla watu wa nijue. Yeah. 10 albums. 10 albums. 100 songs. Na badu watu wa jagubali. Ni songa ni ulikuwa breakthrough yako? Breakthrough yangu ilikuwa song lilimba ini yetuwa Kofi Hanan. I don't even think you know it. It is back then when kulikuwa na post-election violence, 2007. Yeah. Ndiyo nili breakthrough na album, it was volume 9. Ya. Wimbo mode ama new album tu ili hit? I think the whole album, it was nice. Ya, ya. Na now it's in YouTube actually, YouTube music, that is. Album zako zato ziko YouTube? Ya, nime upload soon, all the albums. From volume 1, mpaka all of them. Or any song you want is there. Sasa ngechika kujua Alex, juwe ni msani mkubwa sana Na niki interact na wasani kidogo Na onanga for them to create good music Kuna wanyendo kwa mashambani wanandike uko Kwa visuitu, kudo ingine wanandika wakichana Kudo ingine wakiwa na wasichana Wewe creative space ya kwe kwa aji Ok, yangu It's not like writing a composition Yangu ni music Sometimes yata siya zangi ya leza niliandika ngoma siku gani Aye According to like life situations, ama? No, no. It is comes. It just comes. Iko ndani yako? Ina kujanga tu. Uwezi sayo maati nitaandika ngopi leo. It comes anytime, anywhere. Na beats zinatoka. Iyo ni mtiani watu wanaulizanga, lakini hakuna mtanaza kuambia ti beat na tuanga. Aa, it comes. You just hear it in your mind. Anytime, sleeping, walking, traveling, anywhere, anywhere, anytime. Aya, nikulize, mbona uliamua kwa kamba artist? Ungeimba kiswaili, ungeimba kizungu, mbona kikamba? Nye ni mo kamba, na nene ndete nkita, hache nionge kikamba hile. Nene ndete nkita, hiyo ndio likuwa passion yangu, when I was young. Na ambibu nize nkita, actually nilikuwa class 6. Yeah, very young. Sukulu kanava? Shule. 
shule shule hey. yeah. ulikuwa shule gani mzuri wana wanafunza gita no. si si kwa nasomea ati kwa shule kitambo <laughs> hata nikutoe kwa shule shule za kitambo ni zile unaenda na unarudi kwenu oh, okay eh, oh, si hatu nalala oh, shule oh, ah, ah. <laughs> ni primary school ndio nasoma primary school ya nyumbani mm-hmm. yes eh, so nilikuwa na gita yangu nilikuwa nimetengeneza mm-hmm. na nilikuwa na ski kuna neighbor alikuwa anapita akicheza mm-hmm. so i had to follow him mpaka kwake nisikize tu akicheza akicheza so he kanipa interest nikaanza kujifunza gita mm-hmm. yeah na wazazi walikubali yeah, back then uh, it was my mom only mm-hmm. eh yeah, akuna cool shida alikuwa ananiambia nicheze tu yeah, yeah. ajai niambia no yeah. ah, ah. Yeah. unafikiri alifanya alikubali juu cause of your history ya nyumbani Baba alikuwa msanii ama wazazi wengi sasa hivi unaambia una, unaambia mtoto akuwe msanii okay. back then hata mimi watu walikuwa nani mimi ni mwendo wazimu but my mother mm-hmm. ajaye kuwa na issue any mimi ajaye nionyesha eh. I think I was last born unajua last born wana changwa tu <laughs> ili nisaidia juu mimi hakuwa ananiuliza eh. yeah if you want to play guitar we cheza na yeah. u sibling soko kuna brother sister ambaye ni msanii my first mother's first born na second born walikuwa anacheza kanisani. Alafu wewe ukaamua. But hata sijai waona wakicheza. I was young, ni first born ni, ni, ni mzee kabisa. So oh. miliona anga picha tu. Yeah, Uliku naambiwa tu story. I saw him but sasa back then alikuwa mzee sana, alikuwa anacheza, but alikuwa anacheza. So I saw their pictures. I even have their photos wa kicheza guitar. Hey. When I was two years old. What to two years. Yeah. Wao wako wako ameshika guitar, eh? guitar. So it's something that kwa familia. Yeah. Sasa Alex ningetaka kujua kuna siku unaweza are you in a position to have a collaboration na tuseme artist mwenye maybe anaimba kama Bahati ama Willy Paul ama mwenye si wa Kikamba. Ah uh, nilifikiria tu siku moja I had a song and bado niko nayo. Mm-hmm. But industry yetu ni tricky. Kivipi? Ah, uh, nimeuliza collab na wasanii wengi sana. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, even wa Kikuyu, Jaluo. Mm-hmm. But it's trick na wakamba. Wakamba wana wakisha kupenda venye unaimba, wanataka hivyo. Mm-hmm. So, sitaki kufanya kitu so that is backfires. Mm-hmm. When you are leading the industry, kuna vitu nafaa u avoid. Eh? Yeah. Kama ku confuse fans. Mm-hmm. Dua, kila mtu kuna venye anapenda. Mimi mfanzu wangu anapenda zile ngoma naimba. The way I sing them unaelewa so trying to capture mafanzo wa watu wengine most people fail oh, eh. at that process because unataka kuchukua wale wa ile side no stick to your lane niko na ngoma naweza do collab but zimenishinda niko nazo tu niko zimejaa <laughs> mafanzo wata no i stuck ku, kujaribu kitu mm. trying something do mimi nikianza ngoma nilijaribu kukuwa different and it took me 10 years to be different that's why nimesimama So saa kuanza tena collab na ku twist watu mm. it won't take me like one year ma it take long saa hiyo time ndio hakuna yeah umeelewa mm. sasa nikuulize ushaifanya and people like Kenwa Maria they came who out liwajua mbele before hata tukujue si ndio ushaifanya kwa band za any of them au wasanii wao walikuwa mbele yako uh, no i was a studio artist nilikuwa nachezea watu guitar i ni just ni chezea ken I think two albums like lead guitar nilikuwa nacheza lead eh? mm-hmm. album mbili nikachezea Sanita album kama tatu Sanita ni Water Boys mm-hmm. Kisa si nilikuwa naenda na show juu ni wa nyumbani mm-hmm. anaitwa Kisa si Boys mm-hmm. nilikuwa naenda nao juu huko ndio nilianza kupiga live mm-hmm. yeah hiyo nimefanya naye kazi kidogo nikijifunza mm-hmm. yeah but hao wengine uh-uh. kidogo <laughs> sijawahi but uko open na wakamba kufanya collaborations a uh, for collab size like five di mtu sitani haiko kwa kalenda lakini si ele niko na ngoma mingi sana i have to release siezi mm-hmm. mix i just have my own program na sitaki ku kujichanganya sana lakini mm. alex ningetaka kujua cuz i have noticed for you to stay in the game for hizo miaka zote you have to be very hard working how is your routine like ya kawaida tu kila siku Ah uh, sinanga time hata ku breathe fast because you need to have ama father. Oh, nice. 
So you need to have time for family, time for yourself, time for friends, and then time for work. Yeah. So the seven days a week are actually not enough. Sina time kabisata kidogo. I am busy 24-7, Monday to Monday. Sasa schedule yako inakaji. Legu ulitukua umetuambia unandanga band kutoka Wednesday. Mbaka Friday. Sasa Monday na Tuesday. Uh, Monday is my day to relax. Yodi usiku na pumzikanga. And spend time with my family. Tuesday I visit my studio. I have a studio here in Kilimani. I visit my studio on Tuesday. Check what is happening. Then boom. Wednesday. Kama sina gigi ya Wednesday na Wednesday it's time to meet friends. Hang out, say hi to each other. Then that's this to Nanza na show. Yeah. Okay, that's a busy schedule. Sasa ningetaka kujua how is it being a family man ukiwa kwa industry? It's very simple. It's simple kweli. Keep it secret. Lakini sasa siku na zile challenges za uko na show baka usiku kuna ule crazy fan mwanamke ameona Alex amesema Alex ndo anataka. How do you deal with such situations? When you are working kama mimi niko kwa show. Mm-hmm. Wao wanawake they are more than 200. Mm-hmm. It's very simple. You can't do anything. Na siku na ule crazy fan atakufuata aseme leo. There are too many atakwambia uwezangi kufanya kitu even if you want to. That is very simple. Mwenye anafanya sijui anafanyanga aje. But mm-hmm. I don't know how it works. It is too crazy tena. When you are family man, people will be there open looking what you are doing so that they can you see? Mm-hmm. So it's very simple, just they are fans. You know what you call it? My fans. Yeah. Ushe kwa na encounter gani ukiwa stage, alafu your worst encounter ukiwa kwa stage? Encounter about fans or... Ya kitu chuka kuhapenia kwa stage? Let me think. Nisi kumoja tu gita ili anguka. Ya, ya, ya. Ya kampe ili katika. My security didn't hook it right. So when I was playing, it just came down. Ka anguka. That the first time, second time we look at my fans while you could to Kanguka now. Kanguka, just stage Kanguka. No, ni was Chana, and Kuana, that's our friends. So to keep chase alive, Waka dance, then they Waka Skuma and my fans to Kanguka. That's a good video. Thank God, yes. Ajay, what you could record? This side of Gidurai Network 44. Yeah. Club is in it. It's like 2016, I guess. So, now, best experience? Best experience is in Mombasa. I was in Mombasa, Club Network Kamba Landmark. It was immediately after after COVID. So to go on a gig, mm-hmm. I actually see what I mean because the place was even full. It took me 15 minutes to walk away to go on stage. Yeah, it was full. Fans came. That was the best show I've ever done. Yeah. It was very nice. It was nice. Very nice. Sasa ni kuulize, tungetika kujua. If someone wants to book you for like a birthday, ukujo pa for me a birthday, watakupata aje, na pia, how is your rate card in a range wapi? Oh, mi niko social media, I have an account, which is verified, Alex Kasau Kulukulu. The number is there. There are two men accounts, but mine now it's verified. Kama ni gigs ni two times, kuna ya show, ya live, na kunile ya kuperform kama birthday ni ile anakuja tu na kuimbia ngoma ya birthday yeah. have a birthday song so unani book tu kuna number you just call my number is there and is my number mm. see a manager it's direct number aje mbona umeka direct hapo it is my office ni rais sivyo ndio manipata hivyo ndio nimekupata lakini wao tu wangafu wanapiganga tu uchokozi wengi but you control them hey. yeah you you very disciplined i have one number na ni ya biashara Na yu ndo unatumia yu ndo? Unatumia, that's my number. Ala. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, let's talk about now your music. Umesema kwanza hata you, you have a song you're releasing leo. Yeah, today. Inaitua aje? Inaitua Winnie. Winnie is... Winnie. Akamba ni mesi Winnie ni... It's like Winnie. 
Kushinda. Kuna ah. lakini kuna wini jina ama oh wini. <laughs> si utupatie covers tusikie kidogo. Sitakupea saa hii. Tunguzishie tu kidogo. <laughs> when it's not out, it's not allowed to wait. Ina when na release release kwa YouTube. Oh. Yeah, it's a uh, it's on Boomplay, Spotify, mm-hmm. Apple Music and YouTube Music. YouTube Music not available in Kenya. Mm-hmm. Aiko YouTube ile YouTube at Rwanda wa yeah. aiko yeah. So, siezi imba juu kuna wengine itatoka leo, kuna wengine itatoka kesho, mm-hmm. wengine wanaweza choose kutoka Friday. So sijui inatoka lini exactly, but it's from today. It's out there for them to release it. Sasa mimi request yangu kama ndenya na ma fans juu watu wengi wanapenda pewa pewa the song si utupatie basi ya pewa pewa tusikie sawa tu gani ni mingi eh mimi ni kimbo <laughs> si yoyote chagua your favorite okay ila na thenga ni we mana kana ni mbesa ndo unazia pewa pewa kila mundu wakitomilo Nice. Sasa ningetaka kujua your strategy when choosing the people to work for your band. Umekuwa na hiyo band over the years ama watu wanakujanga wakitoka how do you choose people to work with? Okay, the band as the manager. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Is one who knows who is working who is not working. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So band iko na manager. Yeye yeah. ana control kila kitu. Yeye ana control band. Mimi na control the the brand. Yeye yeah, ana control the band. Mm. Tukimalizia ningetaka kujua Alex, mbona wasanii wengi wa Kamba wanakuanga wana na band? Hakuna very hard upate mtu mmoja tu ako peke yake anaimba. Because it's live. Mm-hmm. It's live. Live you need people to play guitar live. Mm-hmm. Kunaweza yakiwa ile at backup song at ndio wimbo no. Eh. Wakamba sasa mafanzo watu wanataka you play it live. Hiyo guitar hiyo. Hiyo guitar which is a live na drum set. Eh. Uh-huh. Kwanza hiyo drum ndio inawashika kabisa. The whole thing. Really? Yeah yeah. So that's why unaona tunakaa kwa industry for long. Because it's live. Same kwa authentic si watu wengi wanafanya kama nyinyi. Yeah yeah. Na ni live. People want live. Hata ukienda maji utapata watu wanapenda more live than mm. the backstage thing hiyo ya kuimba na mic au na danza za. Mm. So live ita remain. Ita remain na uh... benga ita remain sana for long. Hey. Yeah. Sasa kama ungekuwa unafanya usanii, ungekuwa unafanya nini Alex? Ah uh... Mimi ni sound engineer. Mm. Yeah. Oh, nice. I'm the one who does my recordings in my studio. You do a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'm talented in that part. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Unaona kama mtu anaweza depend on music fully. Kama wewe do you depend on music fully? Yeah, everything comes from my music. Hakuna biashara zingine huko. I do business, but the business is it came from the music. The music is one gave me money so that I I invested on music I sell phones I sell I'm my business man I have shops to sell phones. Sasa yu kweli sasa tukimaliza ya mwisho ningetaka kujua mbona eh wasani wakamba we can count at the artists we have. Mbona ni hard sana tusikie a new artist mwenye anakuja na ana anaingia kwa hiyo nini yenyu akina Ken hiyo squad hiyo ya hiyo ligi hapo juu. Uh, a district wa Kamba they they naweza sema hataki ku learn hataki wanataka ku remain the same place unajua kuna sai uki, hata ukiangalia kutoka last last, last year kuna vitu hazii kuwa hii mwaka zimekuwa mm. you move with it hawataki mm. wako to the same place walianza mm-hmm. kuna watu wameimba like 10 years na bado mtu wako the same place Unless they change the game, I change the game every year. Mm. Kila mwaka mimi na change game. Kivipi? Ah? Huh? Kivipi. You see unaangalia ngatu ni nini na trend what is going on? Watu wanapenda nini kama sasa hii ni TikTok imekuja. Mm. So move with the TikTok. Uko TikTok Alex? Like? Yeah, niko, hey. niko TikTok, niko huko. <laughs> Tutafanya TikTok moja tutaweka hapa kwa interview. <laughs> niko TikTok so unaenda na hiyo wakati. Unaona kama sasa hii kitambo ilikuwa tuna release CDs. Yeah, now saini so nasikia nimesema ngoma inatoka Spotify, mm. Boomplay, hawako huko, bado wako back to ndio sasa wanaingia oh, YouTube. Sasa ndio wanaingia. Is it something that is mental? Mambo tu ya akili ama watu wako wako nyuma, watu wa nyumbani? Kujua. Hawataki kujua. Ukijaribu kuwaelezea wako na ile mentality yani kama wana waibia. Oh, exposure, I want exposure. When you try to explain hii kitu lazima wajui. They want to release music today kesho mtu apate pesa. 
Ya. Yeah. Ama mtu anadhani agenda studio leo uh-huh. kesho atakuwa star. Uh-huh. You need to take time. time. Okay. Na u grow na usikize watu just waangalie tu venye watu wanafanya. Uh-huh. Grow na wao unless wafanye hivyo. Bado tu. Yeah, wako wako kuna wakambo wako more than three, I think 300 to 400 bands. Au unajua ngapi? Bands. <laughs> Mimi najua Ken. <laughs> Alex kila siku uh-huh. kuna band ina record sasa si moja kama tatu new na wanapata show za watu wote 400 no 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 but but sasa si wanataka grow but we have bands kabisa zimeja mm. but talents ni kidogo to kuna watu wana talent shida ni lakini talent ni jung wimbo za kikamba na wanaanga ni kama mtu anaweza tu amka akiandikiwa anaimba yeah kuna watu wanafanya hivyo that's why they are not listened oh hata wewe kidogo kuimba tuende studio unaandikia <laughs> But But for you ukae need content na talent. Bia talent is needed. Wewe ndio umeandika nyimbo zako zote? Yeah. Zote. 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 Nobody ever done in song for me mimi. Eh tu zena niko na ngoma kama sasa niko na 230 something. Sio ni mingi? Mingi ingia ufanye research. <laughs> 230 is ni mingi but you're doing a very good job. Alex nikuulize sasa kwa hizo ngoma zote 230 ni gani ili hit na huko unexpect hit ili unaona unaandika tu for fun lakini hii ndio ikaenda Ah uh, eh ni mingi my song was so many sasa sijui nielezeaje unaandika kadu song ukitoa mm. it's about the fans wakisema wakikubali it's a hit wakikataa go back tena andika tena unaanga expectations wewe unaandika ukitoa tu utajua aje itakuwa hit people choose. Oh. Eh. Yeah. Hata kama unaelewa kidogo, wao ndio wana choose is it hit mm. ama wataki. Mm. Eh, yeah, na wakikataa wamekataa ndio mafans wako. Unarudi tena. <laughs> Unaandika tena. Unaweza <laughs> kasirikia mafans. <laughs> Unatoa tena, unarudi mpaka wakubali. Mm-hmm. But ina ya na making kama two to three hits. Mm-hmm. That's enough. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's enough. That's that's songs upate two hits ama three hits. Ah. Ato. Kama ni mwaka nimefanya ngoma mbili hits. Yeah. The almost moja kwa na almost 2 million views, nyingine kwa almost 1 point. Yeah. Yeah, that's a yeah. hit. Yeah. Na moja jamaliza hata miezi mbili. Mm-hmm. The 2 million was you need. Inaitwa Chadhi. Hiyo ndio inaimbwa kila mahali. Hebu iimbe tusikie. Chadhi hata wewe ujui. Ijue lakini nataka uimbe. Aya <laughs> eh uh, uh, atakwanza ni njoo je ni kitu inafaa kurudi ndio uh. uimbe. Ah. Ah. Tuta jinda baadaye. Utaimba baadaye ukweli tutaiweka. Ijaingia. Ushafikiria kumenta vijana wadogo ambao wanataka kukua kama wewe in future? Yeah, nilijaribu. Nilikuwa na nilianza na KSP. That was 2019. Mm-hmm. Nikakuja nikajaribu ikanishinda because sina support na hao watu pia unaoshaisaidia watu but hawasaidiki. Mm-hmm. So ikakuja ikaisha. Even other group tuko tunaenda na tuko na wafanyia recordings, unafanyia video. Mm. Ikakuja ikaisha. This year again I tried. I changed the name from KSP to KSG. Mm-hmm. Kidogo kidogo pia nao wakashindwa. Sasa nimeacha. Ai no, wanashindwa juu ya nini? <sighs> Ni acha atakamba mimi tu kwa matetha kasa sometimes. Nikie. <laughs> Nikie. <laughs> Ni wako na haraka. Oh, wanataka success ya haraka. Uh-huh. Wajui kama you need to take like two to three years. Mm-hmm. Ukiwa na mama ndio u stand. Mm-hmm. But hii haraka haiwe haiwezi. Ta mean ni ni have to kutoka juu sasa. I have my own band mm-hmm. and kuna wao. Sia siezi kuwa niko onto them yeah. every day ni sawu. Mm-hmm. That's why it needs time. Time hiyo time now hawana. Eh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wataka haraka haraka. Mtu wa kuwa star. <laughs> The easy it comes the easy it goes. Ukimpata jina na mwezi moja, itamaliza miezi mbili ipote. But ukikaa pole pole ujenge jina yako. Mm-hmm. The remains that's why niko. Hapo mm-hmm. tumejua hiyo hiyo tumejua the key to being in the industry for long time. Sasa wewe sisi ma fans tunataka kuja tuone live show. Your next show iko lini? My next show is kesho. Mm-hmm. Niko hapa Kifaru. Mm-hmm. Kifaru iko Mombasa Road. That is on Thursday. Friday Leo ni Wednesday. Leo ni Wednesday. <laughs> Friday niko 
wapi Freddy ni kwa Machakos mm-hmm. showground club inaitwa Carlos Saturday ni kwa na event mbili have a day event hiyo ni harusi ile traditional ya rafiki yangu alafu after party so i do the day and night yeah. oh, ulikuwa unauliza rates by the ni mesa yeah, rates yeah. za mchana kama ni birthday na ma ni, ni pre wedding hizo za wakamba hizo za rura show mm. ni 50000 okay. one song hiyo ya event tu na kuja ni dress kama wewe mm. na kuingiza pale venye unaingia 50k mm. at night it rages nairobi ni 100k Uh, outside kama kitui 150 Mombasa ni 200 na unaimba ngoma ngapi kwa usiku moja sure it's all night it starts 6 to 6 but me under stage between 11 and 2 ama 3 hapo eh na zaingia 11 to 1 12 to 2 ama tu venye 2 hours max mm. Mm. Haya sasa ongelesha mafansi wako hata na kikamba sasa wa appreciate wenye wanakupenda waambie kitu. Akamba ni mwende temono na ningo shukuru miaka zuni mbingi tu yakala. Na naenda kumata biati. Wadhi ni tondo baili. Any day any time. Ni mwezi ndi tula. Any day any time ningo mbinia. Na kawadhi kuka kuma kwa wini. Kaendi le subscribe kwa Boomplay, Spotify, Apple Music na hizo music streaming acha na youtube youtube video itakuja next week probably friday but for now la mena hizo boom play na spotify iko live mtaniambia venye iko moyo wetu kila tio sawa nengi sio ndio kusema ah ndio kusema eh sasa hivi kama ndenya na fans wangu wa kamba tufuatie shout out na spm buzz shout out eh ah ndio za shout out ndio nyenye ndio sawa ndio shout out kwa sia hii eh Sikizen Denya kwa SPMBuzz video ita drop. Ah uh, nendo muda bi mu subscribe kwa channel cha SPMBuzz at one the na na kwenu ni banu nezana bi kwenu. Let me interview you now you. Ni nae masinga actually ni masinga club mpi imefungiliwa hapo. Nilikuwa na event kwa sijui inaitwa kuna club mpya. Big one. Hapo masinga. Eh. SPMBuzz.